Happy Friday. I don't know. And I love that. The more comfortable I am with the less that I know, the happier I tend to be. There's more room for discovery. And I guess commune with other people to interact and learn and But it also, and the beauty of uncertainty, is that jumping off point. How do, how do we each, how do each of us brace uncertainty? Is it an exciting story? <laughs> or is it filled with doom and gloom? Maybe that's the lens that we're looking through, positive, positivity or, or negativity. Both of which accelerate my heart rate if I focus on them and, oh my God, this could be great, or oh my God, it's going to be awful. If it's just an experience that's going to happen, not colored by my judgment or my expectations, for me, that gives me a freedom to just have the, have the experience. Do my best to not be wrapped up in a result. Also, to do, it helps me to show up for the experience without having expectations or Contempt prior to investigation. Oh, I know how this is going to go. If I, no, I don't. <laughs> I mean, I may have an educated experience, or uh, you know, I, I might have. Uh, I can't even think of the word. I'm blanking. But anyway, the more naive in a sense that I can go into each experience that I have throughout the day, the better suited I am to be delighted and to learn something and to enjoy myself rather than entering every moment of my day with a bunch of baggage. <laughs> so I don't know. It's interesting being back and uh, still doing my best to not like triple task all at the same time. There's only so much time in the day and <laughs> I don't have children. I can only imagine that kind of, you know, a juggle. Yeah. Deep breaths, get rooted in the moment. Big light, much love, peace.